pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning. It is Friday, April 28th. Welcome to SCTV News. I'm Nico Slater. And I'm Asaya Johnson. Voting is now open for the ASB and class council elections. You can vote on a computer, tablet, or smartphone. Go to the SCHS homepage, click on the election link, then choose your ballot according to the grade you're in right now. Be sure to choose the correct ballot. Your vote will not count if you choose the wrong ballot, so read the instructions carefully. Vote for one candidate per position. Juniors, be sure to vote for only one senior color scheme. Voting closes at 1 p.m. today. There are over 20 candidates on the ballot that you can appoint to be your school representatives. If you'd like to meet them and see what they have to offer, we've created a video on the front page of the Steel Canyon website to make your decision just a little easier. Hundreds of people are gathering in our community for a special event tomorrow. The Hamul Little League is hosting the Rally for Riley to support the family of an 11-year-old boy who has been diagnosed with a serious illness. Landon Shire has more to help you find out. Riley's a young man from Alpine, now he lives in Spring Valley, and his older brother plays for one of the Humboldt Lily teams, uh, but Riley's been diagnosed with a deadly form of cancer. He is battling it, he's going through chemotherapy. Uh, Riley is, um, he's in and out of the hospital, he's gone through 13, I know that I read at one point um, that there, he's gone through 13 weeks of chemo already. This Saturday, April 29th, at Homola Little League, there are eight different Little Leagues coming together and playing baseball um, in support of Rally for Riley. Some of the things that are going to be raffled off is um, autographed baseballs by, from Riley, but I guess he can only do like one a day. That's about as much strength as he's got. Um, the whole day is about raising funds for Riley. So hoping to get volunteers to come out and help do things from working with the uh, Home Run Derby, which the varsity baseball team is going to come out and work. I mean, watching little four-year-olds hit dingers is, is awesome. Um, to working the bounce house, the pitching thing, selling water at the vending. Hopefully it's nice and hot and there's lots of snow cones and ice cream sold. Generally just picking up and helping with tra trash. We're expecting probably 1,200 people over or from about 7.30 in the morning till about six o'clock at night. We spoke to the baseball team on why they plan on coming and here's the reason. Mr. Dirksen uh, approached the varsity baseball team and explained to us Riley's cause and uh, us seniors decided that it would be a good idea to take the whole entire team out there and support it and I think it would be awesome if you guys could too. And. You know, we have a model to take care of each other. That just that doesn't extend just here, it extends out to the community. You know your time is going to be well spent. The whole point is run as much or to raise as much money uh, to help his family with these difficult times. Riley for Riley is an important cause that could use your help. With SCTV News, I'm Landon Shire. Today is the last day for Cougar Idol auditions. Interested students need to go to the ASB room at lunch today. You'll need to know 30 seconds to a minute of a song. You can either sing a cappella or with the music track. Prom ticket prices go up after today. Right now, tickets are only $30, but the price will go up on Monday. Prom is scheduled for Saturday, May 27th, at the McMillan Event Center in Liberty Station. One of the biggest concert events of the year is happening tonight. The Steel Cannon Guitar, Band, and Orchestra will perform Dizzy Music at the Happiest Musicians on Earth concert. We spoke to a pair of musicians to find out why the show's different. You, when you think of band or orchestra, you think of playing like classical music or so on. But for what well, I like pop is we go more to the modern age and then we play pieces we see every day in life. And it's really cool to know this is what musicians feel and we're playing the same thing. The music begins at 7 p.m. tonight in our theater. Avid Club is selling cookie dough starting today. If you'd like to get some delicious cookie dough, Find an Avid Club member or go to room F205. There are a variety of flavors available and the fundraiser will run through May 12th. 
Artists from Still Can will be showing their work at the Grosmont District Art Show. The exhibit opens next Friday from 3.30 p.m. to 10 p.m. and it runs all weekend long. The show will be at Parkway Plaza between J.C. Penney and Macy's. Entry is free, so bring your friends and family. Varsity Baseball is at Monta Vista at 4. JV plays Monta Vista here at 4. Boys Golf is having a match play at Saquon Carlton Oaks at 2.15. Varsity Softball is playing University City here at 4. Swim and Dive is competing against Valhalla here at 4.30. And finally, Boys Varsity Volleyball is having a tournament at Scripps Ranch at 3. Track and Field is competing in the Escondido Invitational against Escondido, and the time is to be announced. That's all the news we have for you today. Have a great weekend. Raw Raw Cougars, Cougar, Cougar Pride, get some.